another Subnautica episode. Uh, well, I probably should. You can tell by the tone of my voice there's something I messed up. Um, I did record a video, but uh, I became choppy and laggy. But I think I finally figured that e that issue out. Eh, all you really missed was me getting a prawn suit, finally. Um, that's all that literally happened. Um, yeah, I got a prawn suit. And I also got, I'm starting to grow this stuff in this area now. But now, that, with that out of the way, we have a prawn suit. And, uh, we can move forward with the next, uh, thing. Eat that. Um... What was the next thing we had in mind to do? I was thinking we probably should get... Oh, did we get a drill arm on this thing yet? No. We have... We have upgrade. We need, uh... We need the drill arm for this so we can actually be useful. Which we do not have yet. Think we have the blueprint for it? Yeah, we do. Five titanium, one lithium, four diamond. Um... Four diamond. I don't have any diamond, actually. Huh. I'm gonna increase my scanner range, though. Uh, I don't even have any. Eh. Oh no, it's down here. I'm gonna increase my scanner room range, because I also got a scanner room. Which is useful for uh, finding things that are out in the open space of the ocean. And we only have a limited amount of area covering. Oh, it says there's a thing. I'm gonna scan. Well, that's scanning. I'm gonna increase the range. I guess I'll keep the up this uh, speed on for now. And now it should be covering more area. I think it is. I can't tell. And if there's data boxes, it will appear on our screen. And there seems to be one down there. So, with that out of the way, let's get started with this episode. I also got a stasis rifle from a time capsule here, which is probably worth noting. Anyway, let's get to work, shall we? So, the data box is right there. That's and we're back to base. Apparently, that, uh... Brat, that uh thing, that data thing, I already got. I already was down there, so that was like kind of a wasted trip. But we can have other things to scan. Like I primarily could do with some more copper, so I'm gonna scan for limestone, and I might take my mech out to uh, or bronze suit. I'm sorry, cause I uh need more uh copper. Won't be the only thing we're doing this episode. I might plan on going visiting one of these other life pods. Rendezvous spots. That's the only thing I can really visit. I'm gonna take this out because with these little arms I can actually uh, punch the thing and grab the thing so it's easier to just be in the suit. That's what I think anyways. Shoot here. Probably not gonna throw this in here. It's probably a bad idea. Got a lot of resources here. Get to this dangerous area. Gonna move around. I got it. I got a reinforced suit, so I can withstand this heated damage. That's also what I made. I need a better helmet, though. Uh, anyway, let's grab some of this stuff and then we'll probably increase our range, honestly. That blood kelp area, I know it can also find magnetite in. Just further away. I'll just grab this stuff for now. Then we'll evaluate what we need to do next. I think we got what we need at the moment. Trolling this thing is a little janky. I don't know if it's my game or something, but not really easy to control. Anyway, let's just grab copper. I want to increase the range of my uh, scanning thing a little further. Welcome aboard, Captain. 
And that is exactly what I'll do. I grabbed a bunch of titanium while I was at it. There is a lot of chunks in the area, but I don't need that much. Yeah, I need a better sorting system than this, but I'll work on that later. I need, more, I need one more magnet. I know where to get it if I need more. I think our prime objective for this episode is, well, to get this thing a drill arm and uh, explore the rendezvous point. No one's obviously there. Everyone's probably dead, but you never know. And it extends the range even further. Stop scanning, because that takes up uh, energy. That's a lot of coverage, though. Even gets down to the caves. I can scan up magnetite, so I know where those are. And lithium. Might even be better to just give it all the upgrade, all the um, all the range upgrades. The speed isn't really much anything major. Okay, that's good. All right. Uh, what do I have that? I have, what do I have an abundance of that can give its own container? Gold. I have so much gold, I don't understand how. It's like the most common resource. Even though it's gold. gold one. All right. I think I figured it out for now. But I'll deal with it more later. Probably off camera. So I can save you guys your trouble. All right. The drill arm is going to require diamonds, which I need shell out front for. That uh, floating island that I need to go to for the rendezvous point. I think has shell out crops on the along the edges of it. I think. Oh, I might be able to get it there. I also need a rebreather. I'm not using the radiation thing that much, so. unless I already have that. I think I have over. Oh yeah, I have. To. Uh, let's grab. I'm grab you. You are. Uh, you're being sacked. Because why not? Better to eat, better to eat health. All right, uh, fiber mesh. Wire. That's a big wiring kit. Sheesh. Rebreather. Awesome. All right, let's equip that. I'm not using using the radiation thing anyways. I'm using reinforced. The only reason I need the radiation thing is if I'm exploring the aurora, and I think I looted the place. Anymore. Unless the resources are refreshed or something like that. I'm trying to get rid of those outside lockers. Okay, yeah, we're in here. Alright, there we go. That's good. I think we'll be good to go. We should probably make some more water and maybe more food. I mean, since we're already infected, we might as well. Unless I'm cured, which I know I'm not, uh, I should probably change out this battery too, um, before we go. There's a lot of things I gotta do before we go. Sorry. But, uh, when I start get moving, uh, I'll see you there. Three days later. And I think finally we're moving. Whoa. There we go. All right. But we're finally moving. Uh, just gotta grab the beacon so I can put it out here on this floating island. Mark it down. Best safe than sorry. You never know when you need to return to the floating island. I mean, the only two islands in this game are the floating one in the quarantine laser cannon mountain island. Unless there are others I don't know about, which there probably is. Probably is it though. There's more land in the second game there is the first. I guess I'll talk about what happened last time. Uh, we uh, finished off exploring the Aurora and uh, Sunbeam landed, but it was shot down, obviously, because this island it, or this planet's under quarantine because of the Kara bacterium that's infected it. It's individual creatures, and we are also infected. I don't know what stage we're at. I think we're at like the beginning stage. And we're right now we're going to a rendezvous point, which probably has no one in it. Because there are things around called warpers that are killing off anyone with the bacterium. Maybe not creatures per se, but uh, people. That's why we haven't seen anyone else. I mean, they've probably mostly finished off most of them. So, Okay, so we're here at the floating island and we're going to need to look for this. I don't think we're going to see if there's any... Uh, 
But this is the rendezvous point up in here. So nobody would hear the rendezvous. The habitat's down there. It's supposed to be a PDA here, but it's not here. I remember playing in my other save. I found this and went to the rendezvous point. But I think it's only the quarantine island I can find or inside the cave. Well, since we're here, we might as well go to the proposed Dagasi habitat. We can explore that far down. But we got to keep an eye out for warpers because they are hostile creatures that are only hostile towards infected in individuals. I mean, that's their purpose. Whatever the aliens that built them here were to do their missions for, uh, uh made them to destroy any individuals that have the bacteria. Oh, and that's one of them right there. And I think he's after me. That's cool. And you're wondering to yourself, Jester, how can you do? So how can you run up against? run up to something so calmly and not react so scarcely like other YouTubers. Well, I'm not other YouTubers. Luckily, that thing didn't do its... Uh... Didn't... I don't know what it does. I don't know if it just attacks me or... If it does something specific. I'd actually rather not figure out, to be honest, because there's another one right over there. Yeah, I'm looking for this Degasi habitat down here. It... Over there, not too far from it. Since we're here, okay, there's another warper. This place is full of them. Hope he wasn't after me. Okay, here it is, the Degasi habitat. What's annoying is, is there's this annoying floating thing next to it. And there's a warper on the left, bottom, right side. They're everywhere here. This is actually pretty bad. I cannot get near that thing with him. I think she's talking about. I think it was that floating guy. Oh no, it's that guy. Everything is out here to kill me, and there's a whole lot of them in the area. I think we already did that title before. Well, I wanted to explore that habitat, I really did. There is a lot of warpers in the area. And I don't know about you, but I don't want to die. <laughs> I can't really explore that area, but... This area is the Lost River. If I had a beacon on me, I'd mark it down. But it's just connected to the Blood Kelp Zone anyway, so... If I remember correctly, there is an area right here. It's full of Ion Cube. Ripe for the taking. And I think there might be something else. I obviously... I won't spoil it for you. There's also Nickel down here. The resource we'll need for... Many later things. So yeah, we can find Nickel down here. Okay, now it's telling me, not warning me about the death. I think I just need to give myself a rebreather. I need to figure out what's in that habitat, but it's going to be rather difficult to explore it if there's going to be a lot of warpers in the area. You can see one of the infected individuals right there. Why aren't they going after that thing? Huh? What do they have against me? Oh no, I thought that, oh, I thought that was in a war. I can't believe it. I'm a fool. From this angle, it looks like ore. Ugh, I was an idiot. Oh, I didn't really scan that skull, did I? Yeah, I'll be back here eventually anyways. I just want to inspect this habitat if I can. Without interruption. Seems with all these... Warpers in the area, there's gonna be a lot of interruption. It spawned in. We'll park our thing here instantly go into once we're done exploring this nightmare. Hopefully they don't realize I'm inside this building. I don't even know what I'm here for. He sees me. Swim charge fins. That's nice. Okay. Okay, that's just the other guy. I'll inspect that later, but it's that giant. I punched my. God. Let me attack this idiot while he's maybe stunned. 
I think I scared him off. I shouldn't stick around and find out. But, uh, finish exploring quickly and get the heck out of here. There's a second floor. Where's the floor? Or roof, rather. Is there a second floor? I don't see it. There is a second floor. How the heck do I get up there? Okay, I got in here. This better be worth it. Alien containment. I think I might need that. I don't know. Ugh. Jeez, that thing's so close. He's all tell me he can get me from within here. He's literally wanting to get me. I am sweating right now. I'm not gonna lie. This is a little... Get me down here. Okay, that's something else. Oh, orange tablet. I think I need that for the door I saw over there. I didn't scan it. Oh, look at this! Creature egg. I think we've overstayed our welcome. Don't you think, guys? Yeah. Where the heck is my... Get away from my stinking thing. Oh, I got warped. Get the heck away from my machine, you stinking... Oh, I killed him. Although I shouldn't be scanning this right now, I don't care. That's great. Let's get the heck out of here. This stasis rifle doesn't really do much. Just get me the heck away from here. Well, uh, you know, if you enjoyed that, uh, encounter, yeah, hit that subscribe button, that notification bell. Well, now I know what they do. They teleport you out of your vehicle. Real nice creatures, aren't they? Especially when they're everywhere. Okay, I came back this way, or at least this is where the Lost River area was. I think the first thing we do before we end off this episode is build that, uh, alien thing, because I got a creature egg. And if I know anything, you guys probably know what it is. But we definitely knew it to come down here with the bronze suit, though, because I think there's sulfur in these, uh, toxic waters. We can't go in ourselves, because obviously it's dangerous. Unless I can do it with... Oh, let's see, what's it? Cycle CO2. Eh, probably not the same thing. Yeah, here it is. I see it right there. Sulfur. I can't go in myself, because it's toxic. Probably obvious. Okay, now that we're out of that danger zone, let's scan this. Alright, let me play that habitat thing. Where was it? Terminal data. Oh, that's great. Uh, oh, Degasi. Uh, what did I get? Milady. Please, stop fighting and listen. We're sick. What? How? You've been coughing, right? Feeling itchy? Blisters? Yeah. The biometrics would have warned us if we were sick. It's something new. It's not here to date. Come on, man. What's it gonna do? Turn us inside out. Dissolve us into jelly. It's an alien bacteria. It's everywhere. Every organism. On oh, it's Margaret. What's her face? She's in the second game. I recognize that voice. I was watching a YouTuber play the second game, and yeah, that's her. So she was in this. I didn't know she was part of this, but seemed probably obvious. And all this alien stuff, we'll figure it out later. Uh, it said something. Oh, this me boy. Cool. I don't know where that is. Data downloads, artifacts. I didn't really scan the orange tablet, did I? Oh, flora research. This must be it. Local plants being held in stasis. Aliens. If you want to read it, you can pause the video. But we got another one of those eggs that we found in the Degasi habitat. I think I know what it is, but I'm going to let you guys be the guessers what, until we can get back to home base. Let's just get the heck out of here. This place is crazy. I got to mark this down with a beacon, but I'll deal with that later. Probably mark it down at the entrance so I know which way to come in. I think they expected me to enter through this way, and that's why it played that line. Interesting. I already know that. But interesting. Okay, we want to head back that way. 
This was an interesting uh, learning experience, and honestly, I would have loved to do that again. I'm gonna be honest with you, my first uh, Warper encounter went well, I must admit. Oh, I kind of expected him to do much more than that. They're supposed to be alien weapons. You know, used to destroy infected individuals. All he did was warp me outside my vehicle. A little terrifying at first, but it wasn't that far from my vehicle to begin with. I probably shouldn't jinx myself, so I'm gonna just shut up. And uh when I'm back at the base, we'll make make some conclusions. And we're back home. You know, I just realized our original mission was to get this thing its drill arm, but uh kinda got sidetracked, didn't we? No, I don't wanna open this door. I don't wanna get this out of the Bay. Yes, thank you. All right. Put that there. I'm going to park my Seamoth. Anyway, so we've... Man, I'm a great driver, aren't I? <laughs> well, we had an encounter with a warper. I'd say. And that stupid electric jellyfish brain goblin thing. I don't even know what that was. But, as you can tell, it disables every electric appliance, so that's fun. We got two creature eggs that we're gonna figure out where to put... We're gonna put them in... We got an alien container. Requires five glass. Wow. Expensive. Two titanium. Well, I say it's expensive because I don't have a lot of quartz. We'll try to build it and end off the episode that way, but... What other Degasi things do we have here? That. Oh, what was it? Downloads. Within downloads. Uh, here we go. Let's see what else out there. Well, hey, this is an order, so we'll play number eight. Margaret, Maida has boarded the habitat. What are you so happy about, Maida? Mm. Say, kid, I brought you something. Is that a Leviathan outside? Towed it home on the back of the sub. You killed that thing? It's still breathing. I was about to finish the job, but I can stay in chat if you'd like. No? Then make yourself useful and pass me that hardened blade. Are you out of your mind? You brought that thing here? What if it's not as dead as it looks? What if others come? You prefer it got curious and came of its own accord, or it got messed up and dragged here? When we get off this planet, I am going to drag you through every court in the damn Federation. Well, that guy's wimpy. She killed the Leviathan, dude. That was kind of cool, as people would say. Well, people would say many things, honestly, but I'm just gonna just say cool. Yeah, she's in the second game as well. You actually meet her. If you want to know more about that, you'll find a series to watch. Uh, let's see. Well, the original intention was to find diamonds to build the drill arm, but we kind of got sidetracked for the episode. Unless it's a returning episode for after our several months of hiatus, so put away the silver. I need to scan for ports. I'll just put it away in here for now. I'll find a spot for it. I'm trying to make this look different from my other habitat in my other world. We're safe. We'll build the we'll build the alien containment thing in there. Then we'll be set. Let's just get a scan going on so we can find some ports. We need ten. Uh, let's see. I want to do this before I end off the episode. Three hours later. Yeah, that'll work. Uh, let's cancel out the scan and let's put this in and we'll probably end off the video once we put away these there you go. I need to build the hatch right put it on this side boom awesome oh, we can actually plant things in here why well, grab this stuff give this aquarium a little bit of life I'll grab one of more of those uh, creep vine uh, I'm gonna put two of them in there I don't know what that was about. All oh, these things no longer exist in my inventory. I don't know if I'll be in recording, but it's uh, definitely on the record that happened. 
I just had to load out of the game. I think it fixes the bug, but let's just move on. Gel sex are bugged. That's all I can tell you. Okay, there we go. Now that we got a little bit of life in here, we can throw in these eggs. We got two of them. Look at that. They're... They're, they're alive. Look at them. Look at how cute they are. Oh, maybe when they're growing, I'll take that as a screenshot for the next episode. All day it takes long for these things to grow, but... You know. And they're actually not called cute fish. They're called cuttlefish. So, uh, yeah. Anyway, I think that's it for the episode. We, uh, did what we set out to do. We, uh... No, we actually didn't. <laughs> I just realized we were out to go get the drill arm. But we did explore the Degasi habitat, so I guess we kinda did what we set out to do. Still didn't. I'm gonna probably go looking for diamond off camera when I'm finished with this episode, which I am now. So, uh, like and subscribe. The series is back. There are a couple months. Oh, we got a message. Alright, we'll look at this and then we'll end off the episode. Let's see, what do we got? Playing partially translated broadcast. Destroyed mode. Patrol. New targets unaccounted for. One. The warpers are talking about me. I'll see you all in the next episode while I go hiding out. See you in the next one. Peace out, everyone.